Well, the baby formula shortage still impacting local families. So caretakers told Creme 2 at the beginning of the nationwide formula shortage, they then had to buy other types of formula to keep their babies fed. Creme 2's Janelle Finch spoke with one mom who's now navigating another shortage. Janelle? Shelby Lucas Brunner says at the beginning of the national shortage, Similac formula was hard to find. She switched to a new brand and now her baby's adjusted. But the struggle now is finding the new formula. When Shelby Lucas Brunner had her baby four months ago, she didn't expect to be in the midst of a nationwide formula shortage. She now spends four to five hours on her days off looking for food for her baby. You gotta just fingers crossed when you walk into the store, you can find it. She says Similac formula used to be hard to find. But now the formula that was available when Similac was out, including the kind she needs, is wiped from the shelves. We had to flip flop through five different formulas, I believe it was. And he has some stomach issues and so he had a hard time on those. And then we found the Gerber Sooth Pro, which is what he's on now. But now that everyone is switching from Similac to something else, you cannot find it anywhere. She says her baby's stomach issues make it difficult to switch formula again making a hard situation even harder. And it definitely makes me feel really bad because I know switching formulas, his stomach's hurting. Because even though you can switch from one sensitive to another, they're different. They can be different in the smallest ways, which will hurt your baby's stomach really bad. The Abbott Nutrition Factory in Michigan originally shut down in February, contributing to the national shortage. The company restarted production July 1st and says formula should be available in the next four to six weeks. Shelby says her worries won't go away until she sees the formula on the shelves more consistently. Once I see that there's formula um, staying in stock is when I feel like I won't have to stress so much. But until then, it'll always be a like kind of like a worry like okay he has formula today will he have it tomorrow with the abbott factory restarting production relief for parents could be on the way but the company says it could take six to eight weeks to restock grocery store shelves which could further the problem for parents and caretakers wanting to provide in the newsroom janelle finch crumpton news